Hi everyone, a few days ago I made a video about my Omni Watt meter and it broke after like a couple of months of using it and I was trying to fix it in my video. I couldn't fix it and I decided to delete the video because I thought it would be a little bit boring and people might think that oh hey he's got something wrong with Omni, why does he keep making Omni videos, maybe he doesn't like them. Well, I decided to get rid of the video, but then today, this light bulb, which is also from Omni, has stopped working. You can see a minute ago I had a different bulb in here, it was working, but this bulb doesn't register any power usage at all. Um, basically, I turned on the switch, it came on for a split second, and then it turned off, and yeah, it's now broken, doesn't work anymore. So, as you can see, it's from Omni, and it's rated at 16 watts. And it's a pretty big light bulb. I actually have two of these. The other one is still working. Um, I've had it for around a year and of course it's already broken, which is pretty poor. Now normally what goes in these is not the LEDs, but the power supply. So I figured we might as well open it up and take a look. Now of course they normally use like so much glue on these that they're pretty much impossible to open without damaging. Um, so this will be a destructive teardown. So I open it up with a little bit of brute force and you can see it's got a big LED panel and this is what the strip looks like. It's got some thermal paste on the back to join up to this metal plate here extra cooling so that seems like a pretty reasonable solution although we don't know how thick this metal plate is at the moment and of course all the heat is still contained inside the lamp because there's no air holes to let the heat escape and here we go with a bit of brute force I was able to remove this plate so here's the power supply and although it smells a bit hot it doesn't smell burny and I can't immediately see any damaged components um, but one thing we should do is check the LED strip to see if any of the LEDs can come on. Now I did try and put a voltage here and although it drew a lot of power it wasn't able to light up. Now that might just be the fact that my power supply isn't powerful enough to light this up but let me show you. I've got 4.7 volts here that's connected to one of the LEDs and you can just about see it dimly light up but if I set it to 6 volts you can see it's pretty bright. Now if I try and power the whole board at 6 volts, it draws around 1 amp, which would be 6 watts, but none of the LEDs actually turn on. Let's try and remove it from this power supply. And interestingly, this time, it's not drawing any power at all. So previously, we must have been pushing power into the power supply instead of into this LED module. So I'm not exactly sure what's gone wrong, but this LED module just isn't drawing any power at all now. And the only way to get it to take power is to individually try and light an LED. Very strange. I'm going to connect my 6 volt power supply to this and see if it draws any power. Okay, so that's where the 1 amp was going. It's actually drawing 1 amp if I connect my power supply. So the strip itself won't draw any power at all through these terminals. So something has definitely gone wrong with this LED panel. But the power supply itself is still outputting power. And we can test that with my voltmeter so you can see we're measuring around 4.5 volts output so okay the power supply inside appears to be working okay and if we try and power individual LEDs they work okay but if we try and put the power through here it doesn't work so somehow this LED board has been fried and that's why it's not working anymore but funny enough the actual LED modules themselves they're still working so that shows these LEDs really are indestructible but how you make your design and the kind of board you make will determine whether or not the product lasts um, so yeah that was just a quick video I don't know if it'll be interesting to anyone but this is a Omni light bulb and it lasted for around a year so if you have any questions put it in the comment section down below and if you enjoyed this video please give a thumbs up and subscribe Thanks for watching.